Elizabeth Tharp here with for KAGS News with Sheriff Sal. Sal, um, first day you get called to this scene. Every day since then, you've had this almost not spirit, but hope, mm -hmm. you know, that that Christopher was out there. How did you maintain that this entire time? Oh, uh, prayers. Just it's nothing but prayers. I, I, I just express that to everybody, media, the searchers, the public, uh, the message y'all sent out. Just keep looking. Did we, what do we miss? The search has done a phenomenal job uh, with the uh, ground searches, the dogs, the boots on the ground, the intelligence, investigative intelligence. We were looking at it from all different angles, the helicopters, the drones, everybody. Uh, but all that's all good, but the bottom line of the story is alive and well. When you when you first got to the scene, I mean, day one, Wednesday at 2 p.m. when you yeah. got that call, what was going through your head that day versus what's going through your head right now? Well, all the, you know, you got to look at the big picture. If it's this or that or what, and I didn't want to think the worst. So we looked at the being lost at first, and we did he drown in a tank? We 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 done all you know all that we. We did everything we could to deduct every possibility of, you don't want to think about these things, but kids have gotten locked into an open band of refrigerator or a well or a tank, a stock tank, or all these things are going through your mind and time's, on, time's beating you up. Time is beating you up. Then, then dark comes. What's this little boy thinking? Where's he at? What's he thinking, you know? Then the daytime comes and nighttime comes and so you know time was running out we all knew that we didn't want to did not want to think the worst and we were not going to leave until we found him I, I made that crystal clear from day one um, and the dedicated people here uh, I think they follow that same theory we're going to stay until we find him and we hope for no not a bad circumstance like an abduction we were hoping and praying it wasn't that we deducted through process elimination, alibis of everybody in the family, extended family. There didn't seem to be any, didn't seem to be any criminal uh, motive here. And that's why I kept coming back to y'all saying, I don't have any news, it's, it's crazy. I don't understand this. So, the fortunate thing was he was just lost, simply lost in the woods and some some good Samaritan out there, I don't know who he is yet, and I, I just didn't have time to get into that, but uh, all I know, he had a heavy face too. And so, good conclusion. Good conclusion, and yeah. one last time, um, the emotions, Christopher is on his way to the hospital right yeah, now with, with his, his mother. mother, just a little thirsty. I mean, the emotions coming from you all here, being here for the past almost four days, but also her, I mean, can oh, you just was, walk you me know, through what she's thinking? Watching a mother, she's been a great lady, don't get me wrong, she's been a fantastic, strong lady and we've had uh, my Sergeant Smith being with her the whole time. She's Hispanic, a bilingual, had a lady from the FBI has been with her too. She's bilingual, Hispanic, that made it, that made it comfort for her. And they, their family, so I think they helped keep her strong. And then to see her, she did not lose faith. She, did not, she just was a strong, strong mother. And uh, just a freak moment of uh, looking away and well, you, you just never know about these things. If, if you get the opportunity, do you think you would go and visit Christopher in the hospital or when he returns? Do you want to see him again? Or? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got Sergeant Smith with him. She's, she's riding an ambulance with Mother and, and Christopher. She's my ambassador. I can't be there. She's going to keep me informed. And if he stays in the hospital for a length of time or they check and release him, then I'll, be, I'll probably come see him up here. Sounds good. I'll make him a junior deputy. I think I'll give. I'm, I think I'll give him a junior deputy badge. I think he. I think he would like that very much. Yeah, thank you all very much for your time. Thank you Appreciate so much, it. sir. Thank you. you.